Hello Sagittarius, welcome to the channel and this is going to be your monthly tarot reading May 2018. Four cards spread, the first card that shows up the topic of the month for you Sagittarius is. The next card that shows up things you can go for during the month. The third card expresses the best course of action that you can take. The fourth card that shows up the challenges that you Sagittarius needs to face during this month and the last one is showing up the final outcome. Alright, so uh, let's go to the first card right now and this is going to be the judgment, the judgment card as a topic of the month and judgment card is a, a sign of um, a fateful event. Judgment is that wake up call. Sagittarius is, which actually makes you realize the true direction of your life or taking up the new direction of your life. Now, uh, usually this card is displayed like the hub falls into the shaft, so many things are gonna become um, logic for you, or kind of like if you have a situations which uh, you have been baffled from, all right? Um, the situation now will start taking up meaning. Now this card is a, a big revolution regarding career in the sense of the way you think about your career. Many people when that card comes uh, comes up they have a change into their career or their career taking up a new height because the whole system of beliefs does change for the subject and this is what is going to happen with you but <clears throat> it's gonna be toward a, a positive end with the judgment because the judgment is one of these cards that points that the universe is gonna call for you and it's going to be a whisper and you need to answer the call uh, however this card also have a, a very practical positive meaning in the sense that things which um, annoyed you till now and aggravated you till now you're going to quickly realize that they are inevitable to be attended to which means that uh, during the month uh, you Sagittarius um, <clears throat> will uh, take care of those kind of uh, enterprises which you would rather not want to with much more ease than usual and uh, you will all you will do it, you will do them you know and you don't have to deal with them anymore further into the future the card also may mean pregnancy for the women and the card mean big uh, big revolution as i said into one's life in general well basically in um, in the way of reading as the full journey this is the final line before you know the final straight line before the finish here as you reach completion and then we do have things which you can go for during the month and that will be the seven of swords and the seven of swords is about having a strong spine the seven of swords is about getting what you have been on to and moving yourself away from the battle that you don't belong to and start making progress towards your own personal agenda that being said this month it will be very personal month taking at these couple of cards where now instead of working for the for others you will start working for yourself instead of pleasing constantly your partner into your relationship and finding yourself miserable of that now you will start pleasing yourself and play by your own personal rules is all about that starting to play your game guys not other not other um someone uh, someone else's game you know but your own personal game very important here with the seven of swords when it comes things you can go for is to take a precautionary measures not to be deceived or uh, cheated especially when it comes to a relationship when you see something strange happening here this could be your hints of the universe and you need to take a precautionary measures regarding it all right <clears throat> So uh, this month, for what it seems, looking at just these two cards will be a very potent in a sense that you will now restore a certain balance in a sense that if you have been deprived from certain rewards and if you have been deprived from certain accolation and as well appreciation, um, <clears throat> then uh, this month you are going to receive everything you have been bereft from in the past and then we do have the best possible course of action here and that will be the two of cups wow okay so two of cups here does expresses that you need to make a contact with somebody 
somebody that does not be, somebody which is not afraid to share either your good fortune or your pain in other words this card does shows that you you should not face that call of the universe on your own but there is a, a person there as i said that is ready to share uh, your pain and to share your happiness as well and when those things share the happiness is going to become a double happiness and the pain the pain is going to become half a pain but this card regarding your career it does mean guys that <clears throat> you need to spend time only where you are finding yourself cherished praised and as well um, supported all right because this card reflects to a, a very secure and as well uh, how can I place it comfortable environment into one career um, and under comfortable I don't mean solid but I mean where you're finding yourself uh, supported by your co-workers and for relationship it is obvious here it does look like that you're going to find love no matter what guys you're going to find love either outside your current relationship or either you are single here uh, <clears throat> the, the call of the universe is gonna direct you toward love all right and by looking at these cards uh, this example comes to me uh, that uh, someone for example is trying to be in a relationship with you asking you for dates etc etc but uh, it's kind of like you're not finding them attractive and out of nowhere it comes different person which this time you find them attractive and you start maintaining communications with them making contact with them you know and of course this means that you need to go for your own personal agenda leaving the first one even if this doesn't like them and even if you can't please them you know and going for the one that can actually share your happiness and share your pain as well <clears throat> then we do have the card showing up the challenges that you need to overcome three of swords healing of a poignant experience it is what that card it is talking about as well as realizing that uh, truth is truth and you cannot do anything about it but accept it that being said with the version of uh, for example cheating um, into one relationship that could be true all right but in the same time you score uh, you Sagittarius excuse me are going to find love elsewhere it is just do not abandon the sense of that you can find love guys if you cannot find it find it in one place you definitely will find it in another if right now you are not feeling loved it is because you are seeking love not in the place where you can find it all right and this month exactly the universe itself uh, with the judgment card Heart is going to direct you into that <clears throat> place where the, the other person uh, is ready to basically give the whole of them for you so right now as we are seeing it it is not that much about career than seeking for love Sagittarius says and you guys uh, my friends are about to find the full extent of it for what it seems even if you had painful ex and poignant experience in the past and you have lost faith into the human nature of being able to give love to others now during this month you Sagittarius are going to restore that belief and uh, <clears throat> you know this trust of that people are capable to love another human being and when it comes to uh, <clears throat> work and relationship then these cards speaking for a an unconditional support by a co-worker or supervisor even though um, in the past you have been quite slumbered beneath the toe you know right now you're going to find actually that people can support you in a certain way and then at last we do have the outcome of all that we have the queen of wands and as i spoke about the human nature here you will obtain acute sense into it right now and not ever again in case these conditions here are kept and you go for them you will be deceived by empty words you know and by celluloid propositions you know and uh, celluloid promises as well but you will be able to foresee and scale exactly how much a person saying the truth and how much they lie and also this card points that you will obtain 
very big acute business sense due to this month guys by going for um, this call of the universe here and following your own agenda surrounding yourself with a uh, people that will support you into your career and accepting that everybody is capable of making mistakes all right you are going to obtain such a big business sense and you will show such a leadership um, qualities here a, a readiness to sacrifice yourself for example for the goodness of the team that you will put your boss or your supervisor under serious consideration that you do deserve a, a promotion and most likely a, a promotion will come for you in the near future that being said Sagittarius this was your tower reading for May 2018 guys I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and in case you're interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rod signing out now see you next time bye